guys thanks for coming to check out today's video so today's video is all about a new synthetic wig that was sent to me by so good bb thank you so much so good bb for sending over this unit now let's go ahead and jump right into it Before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you never miss a new upload from me. And uh, yeah, let's jump right into this new wig. It is an Outre wig. It's not brand new. It's been around for a little bit, but I am reviewing her today. This one is called Athena and I have her in a 1B. Been a long time since I did just a straight up 1B, you guys, so let's keep our fingers crossed for this one um, if you like this unit I'm rocking right now there is a review of her on my channel and I will leave a link in the information bar down below where you can check out that video and I'll leave a link right here but make sure you finish watching this one first so this is what Miss Athena looks like she has a lot of flowing layers, which I love. She is long, looks like she's maybe 24 um, inches or 26 inches or so. Lots of layers, lots of curls, and a nice bang on the side with a left side part. Um, she doesn't look like she has any baby hairs added to her. I did already cut off the lace. Um, so you will have to cut the lace on her. Um, she has two combs in the front, one comb in the back, two adjustable straps. And she has a bunch of filler hairs at the top here. She has a lot of volume at the top in the bang area. I did add some powder into the part. So that's already done. And I did adjust the straps in the back to the second tightest. So I'm going to go ahead and take this one off. My baby hairs are pretty much already laid down from before, so I'm not going to um, fool with them. And yeah, you guys, she looks pretty good just straight off the bat. Um, without too much blending or work, she is pretty much good to go. Yeah, she's about 22 or 20, 22 inches, 24 inches or so. She has a lot of volume and a lot of curls. I'm going to go ahead. Wow, she feels a little tangly, but let's see how she combs out. I'm just using a wide tooth comb here. She's a little tangly, especially to be coming straight out the box like this. I'm a little surprised at how many snags I'm getting just like straight out the box. And this wig is not super like thick or full. For me to be getting all these tangles is a lot. The texture on the unit doesn't seem particularly yakky to me. It just has like a nice natural texture to me. Not yakky or anything, but um, not like super silky either. This is a lot of filler hairs. Like that's a whole, whole lot. Um, I think it might be just a touch overkill. Um, I don't think it's really the style right now to have really, um, big hair at the top. It's a style to have big hair in the front, but not at the top. She's cute, probably for a special occasion, um, where you're really trying to like do the most. Great photo shoot wig great statement wig but um for every day i think she's doing a lot but then again obviously she's not meant to be an everyday wig if this wig was red she'd be like the perfect jessica rabbit wig because jessica rabbit's flip was crazy insane like this so anyway you guys yes let me turn around so you can see this unit from all sides So here she is, super cute. Um, just a few little downsides, but for the most part, she is cute. She reminds me of Adriana from um, Sensational, which I was obsessed with and in love with. Um, this one's pretty similar, pretty similar. 
All right, you guys, love you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications so you never miss a new upload. And if you're interested in this unit, then definitely head over to SoGoodBB.com so you can go ahead and get a little more information about her and check her out. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one.